Alright, we're almost done. Here in the fifth section is where we're going to use <coughs> the script that we uploaded uh, to the uh, um, new domain, the one that's called search replace db2. So up here on the domain for the or the URL for the new domain, we want to type in the uh, uh, script uh, uh, name, which is called search replace db two dot php um, and hit enter and that should bring up this script as soon as the website loads of course uh, slow loading speeds this morning have uh, interrupted a lot of this There we go. You should get this safe search replay, or re replace. Um, and again, you, you, uh, you, we've already uploaded it to the new domain, so we should be ready to go. It says pre-populate the database values from the ones used in the Word WordPress config, and we'll leave that just as it is. Hit submit. Again, loading slow. Usually it takes just a few seconds, but not today when we're trying to demonstrate. Okay. Next, you should have the database details. They should already populate. That's why we kept the uh, box checked uh, back on the previous step. Uh, we want to submit uh, DB details. We want to make sure all our tables are highlighted. This leave GUIDI, G U I D, column unchanged. Do not check that. Leave that just as it is. Uh, hit continue and it'll give you this little warning you sure you want to do this and of course we do we hit OK and this is the uh, most critical step here you want to make sure you, you plug in the correct URLs for the existing and new domain so as soon as this come up I can show you what that is here we go so in this case we want to search for and replace with search for is going to be your existing domain so in this case it's we buy houses ky or houses in ky dot com the uh, replace with is the new domain where we want it uh, where we transferred everything to, and it's we purchase NJ Homes.com. Now, this has to be correct for this to work, so I always go back and double check. Okay, this domain is we buy houses in Kentucky dot com so if I need to you can even cut and replace to make sure that you're in there and in this case we purchase homes copy and you can cut and paste that way if it's uh, a little more secure for you but double check make sure this is correct also there is no HTTP or www dot before the domain name okay it's just strictly the domain name so we're going to search for the existing domain URL and replace it with the new one because as you can see uh, everything 
is still linked to the existing domain so when you click on the website itself you're going to go to the uh, URLs from the existing domain not the new one so we'll go ahead and hit submit string it'll ask you if you're really sure you want to do that we'll say sure it'll be done just in a few seconds alright um, at that point this step of the uh, process of the transfer is done uh, I would recommend that you go and connect um, to um, hold on one second uh, I would go to the first take away the uh, PHP file make sure the domain loads correctly and at the same time I would go and connect to the new domain uh, using my FTP client and once that's up I would remove the search replace db2.php file that does create a, a risk to your site if you leave it uh, there permanently so uh, let's see here we are and there is that file where is it I just saw it there we go search and replace right click it you can delete it and sure we want to do that and that should be that and that should be the end of this step uh, I'll see you on the last step here in just a second